All right, much brew time. Playing some blue black, slightly piratey mid range super sweetness. Dot deck. <laughs> in standard. Uh, name still in progress. <laughs> uh, all right, I think we're just going to Storm Tamer. I mean, Storm Tamer's in the deck mostly so we can look out to Dispersal on turn two. Or for two mana later in the game. Island for our opponent. And passes. Well, let's get in with Storm Tamer. Hit our opponent. So this is probably blue-white approach. Could be something else, but that's the most likely most likely thing it could be. Play Catacombs. Pass the turn. Opponent. Opting. Opponent opting. What do you got, opponent? Plays a tap land. Yep. Definitely an approach deck. Another hostage taker. Yeah. Another hostage taker is not great. This is an awkward hostage taker matchup. Get in for one. And run out. Gifted Etherborn. Pass the turn. Glacial Fortress for our opponent. And passes. Freebooter is pretty sweet. Let's go attacking. I don't think we freebooter this turn, though. I think we wait until next turn. Next turn, we can freebooter and leave up Lookout's Dispersal, which I think is where we want to be. So, pass the turn. Opponent cycles. Yep. And cycles. Land number four. And passes. Champion Wits is pretty good. Let's go attacking. Hit our opponent. Run out freebooter. Opponent going to counter. Or Glimmer. Alright, they're going to let it go, which is actually pretty good news for us. Because we saw this lookout dispersal. Fumigate, Fumigate, Settle the Wreckage, Glimmer, Supreme Will. Alright, so we just take a... Huh. I think we just take a Fumigate. And pass the turn. So opponent is able to Glimmer here, unfortunately. There's the Glimmer. But we can counter the second Fumigate, and then counter the Settle the Wreckage. Opponent plays a land. Alright, so counter Fumigate. Opponent passes. Run out Champion of Wits. Discard Hostage Taker. Discard, I guess just Hostage Taker. Play the Swamp. Go attacking. Hit our opponent. We're actually, like, semi-close to closing out this game. I mean, it depends on what's in our opponent's hand, but... If they found the third Fumigate, then we could be in trouble. Opponent passes. Deadlands isn't exciting. So play Scavenger Grounds. Attack with everything. Counter the Settle the Wreckage. Hit our opponent to three. And run out Scarab God. And, I mean, this is it. Pona needs something pretty good here. Cycling Irrigated Farmland is not necessarily it. They gotta find a Wrath. Another Settle the Wreckage. Does Approach 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Oh, they found another Fumigate. Oh, opponent! What a draw! What a draw! Off the top! Uh, now our opponent has a chance again. We had them straight up dead, but that Fumigate was... That was a good one. What do we draw? Faraska's Contempt is not a good one. So we're just going to Eternalize Champion. Do some drawing. Do some discarding. Discard Faraska's Contempt. Discard the second Scarab God. And pass the turn. Kaisale Freebooter is a good draw. We know our opponent has yet another Fumigate, because they got it back from our last Freebooter. Opponent Cycles. They're getting close to where they're going to start casting Approaches, which is a bit scary. We don't have any counters in hand. We know they have Supreme Will as well. Opponent plays a tap land. So they have 7 mana, so they theoretically could approach. But it looks like they're not going to yet. Walk the Plank is not good. So let's play Catacombs. Get in with Champion of Wits. See what our opponent has. Opponent takes it. 
Well, let's run out Freebooter. See what's in our opponent's hand. Torrential Cast Out Fumigate. So if we take Cast Out, I mean, I guess we just take Fumigate and make them cast out our Freebooter. Run out Champion of Wits. Opponent's going to cast out. Yep. Get rid of our Freebooter. Yep. Get back their Fumigate. Yep. All this was stuff we knew about. Uh, sure, we will pay for your Supreme Will. So opponent's hand is Sensor Torrential Fumigate. All right, so we get to draw and discard. Get rid of this Walk the Plank. So I think our opponent's probably priced into Wrathing here. Actually, get rid of Fatal Push. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, we'll get rid of Walk the Plank. Because... Keeping the land means we have enough mana that we can Scarab God and immediately eternalize something with Scarab God. We'll see if our opponent Rass. They could try to Torrential, I guess. They're going to Glimmer. Hmm. What did our opponent draw? Are they Glimmering for a land so they can Wrath? There's a land. There's the Wrath. So Sensor, Torrential, and one unknown. Good news is... Oh, and Lookout's Dispersal. Well, play the land, run out the Scarab God, and just pass the turn. See what our opponent does. If they have Approach, we can just counter it. And if they cycle Sensor, I mean, worst case, we just get back this Champion of Wits. Opponent's passing. I mean, I think we do it. I guess we could lose our Scarab God, but I think it's worth it. All right, here comes Champion. Draw four, discard two. Discard Noxious Gear Hulk. Discard... Um, discard Drown Catacombs. One, two, three, four. So they can pay for... Ooh, wait, I think we have it now, hopefully. We Scry, drain for one. I think we keep Liliana. Play Deadlands. Reanimate Freebooter. Reanimate Freebooter. Do the hand check. If they go Torrential, settle the wreckage. We have multiple ways of dealing with that. Either just Scavenger Grounds or Reanimate and Sack Siren Storm Tamer. So do the hand check. Oh, we got it. All right, sweet. Take Glimmer. Attack with both. And that should just do it. Opponent doesn't have anything they can stop us with. One, two, three, four, f Yeah, so we can just... Dispersal? I mean, I guess we got, like, a ton of different ways to stop this. Oh, that's not a pirate anymore. All right. So I guess we got to pay one more mana, which is fine. I forgot that turns into a zombie. Sweet. Well, that went pretty well. And now we get a ton of action. We get to bring in Duresses. We get to bring in the Gates. We get to bring in Doomfalls. We get to bring in a Jace and a Liliana. We get to go down the Fatal Pushes, which are pretty bad. Go down the Walk the Plank. Go down Trial of Ambition. Go down Noxious Gear Hulk. Go down at least one Veraska's Contempt. They do have Torrentials. I mean, I guess we got the Doomfalls. Let's go down both Faraska's Contempts and one Hostage Taker and try it like that. I'm not sure what our opponent even gets to bring in. Seems like they have a lot of their best cards already in their main deck. Oh, man. This hand has a lot of cards that we like in this matchup, including our Jace, but we can't, we can't keep the one lander. This hand is much worse, but we'll try it. Second Storm Tamer... I think to the bottom. I think we want higher impact cards than another Storm Tamer. S especially since we already have one Storm Tamer. Opponent leads on a tap land. I'll play Fetid Pools. Pass the turn. Glacial Fortress for our opponent. Play Catacombs. Get down our Storm Tamer. And pass the turn. Might as well play around Potential Sensor. Storm Tamer is actually super key against Settle the Wreckage. Glacial Fortress for our opponent. And passes. Duress is pretty good. 
So get in with Storm Tamer. Hit our opponent for one. Play the Swamp. Duress. If our opponent wants to spend a real counter on Duress, Duress is still still doing its job. All right, opponent Ops. Cycle Sensor. Interesting. Settle the Wreckage, Double Disallow, Ixalan's Binding, and Glimmer. So we'll just take Glimmer, run out Gifted Aethermorn, and pass the turn. So we know our opponent's hand. I mean, our clock isn't that fast, but thankfully our opponent's hand isn't that good. Plays the Island. We get a Hostage Taker. Well, let's go attacking. Hit our opponent. Opponent takes it. So play Deadlands and pass the turn. Opponent, Cycle Sensor. Looking for lands, most likely. Ops. Definitely digging for lands. Does not hit a land. Oh, boy. Well, we get to Cycle Fetid Pools. This is our turn to stick something. Oh, Scarab God. Fetid Pools. We'll go attacking. Hit our opponent. Run out our Doomfall. Duress mode. Oh, so many counters. What do we take? How do we close out this game? So Torrential's the best card, but our opponent needs two lands to get to it. Settle the Wreckage makes us sack our Storm Tamer. Or just get some lands. Ixalan's Binding gets rid of Scarab God. We could... Jeez, I'm not sure. What do we take? This is super close. We obviously don't take counters, because our opponent has a million of them. I'm almost tempted to just take Ixalan's Binding, since that gets rid of Scarab God, but it's such an inefficient removal spell. We can counter settle the wreckage if we need to. So we take Binding. Our opponent doesn't necessarily have to settle the wreckage, though. They can take a couple more hits. I think we're going to take Torrential. I don't think we can win fast enough to make Torrential not good. That's basically where we're at. Opponent draws a land. Yeah, so it seems less likely that we'd win fast enough to make it not good. Would still be fine with drawing just like another dress or something. It's a swamp. Well, go attacking. Hit our opponent. Opponent takes it. Play the Swamp, pass the turn. I mean, we know our opponent's hand, it's just all removal spells. Alright, they draw a land. We still know our opponent's hand. It's still all removal spells. Duress? Ooh. Oh man, this is good. This is potentially good. Go attacking, hit our opponent. Now if they settle the wreckage... They settle the wreckage. Disallow, disallow, binding, essence scatter. So, Sack Storm Tamer, get in for two, and run out our Liliana, make a 2-2, two -two, pass the turn, mill a couple of lands that we didn't really want. Now our opponent probably has to spend their turn Ixalan's Binding, our Liliana, then they drop to four, and then they need a top deck to get out of this, because their hand is just three counters. Yup. There's the Binding. There goes Liliana. But they're still in a position that they have to top deck something this turn. Oh boy. Oh boy. Well, let's get in. Hit our opponent. And pass the turn. Alright, opponent. Can you top deck? That is... That is the question. They have to hit a removal spell or a Torrential. Gideon of the Trials. Alright, so... We look out Dispersal. So our opponent did top deck for a turn. Opponent disallows. They could have just paid for it, but that works too. So this does keep our opponent alive temporarily. It also means we resolve a Scarab God. Which means our opponent does have to top deck again. Well, hit our opponent. Well, this is, this is it. It all comes down to this. Run out, Scarab God. Pass the turn. All right, opponent. Can you top deck a second turn in a row? The pressure is on. Emblem's Gideon. 
Okay. That doesn't do it. They still need a removal spell. Ixalan's binding. Keeping our opponent just barely alive. They top deck two turns in a row. All right. Second top deck in a row. So kill Gideon. Hmm. Play hostage taker. Opponent counters. All right. Well, free booter. Take your last counter. Sooner or later, our opponent's going to draw a land. Opponent's empty-handed. They got to they gotta whiff. Counter spell, land, game ends. Cycles, redraw. Opponent passes. Not scooping, though. We draw a land. Could they really have just hit settle the wreckage? Attack, attack. Did they really just draw into it? Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Oh, the running. Oh, the running. Past the turn. That is four turns straight. Our opponent is top deck. Four in a row. Opponent passes. We somehow keep drawing lands, even though we have n hardly any in our deck. Get in with Freebooter. Opponents to one, pass the turn. Come on. Come on. It's only fitting. Oh my. Oh my goodness. Oh, I'm going to lose it. I'm going to lose it. Oh, I'm so going to lose it. We draw Lookout's Dispersal. Isn't very helpful now. Wow. Oh my god, we're going to lose from here. Oh. Oh my goodness. Oh no. Oh wow. It was really like one in a million. We can't cast Scarab God because of Ixalan's Binding. Oh my lord. They drew something else? They draw an Opt. I've never seen anything like this. Not like this. Wow. Takes up Gideon. And we're just not drawing anything. We hardly have any lands left in our deck, but we're not drawing anything. Play the island, pass the turn. And I mean, yeah, we're going to lose now. Wow. Ticks up Gideon. Because we actually have to kill the... Now our opponent draws lands. We keep drawing lands, somehow. Pass the turn. Opponent plays a land. Well, it doesn't matter anymore. Oh, those four turns. Four turns in a row. Opponent gets in with Gideon. Passes. Well, we get to duress. See if there's anything in our opponent's hand. Opponent disallows. Hit our opponent. Down to zero. We... Do we still have one Veraska's Contempt in our deck? We have a million of our loot effects. Oh, man. We haven't drawn a single champion of wits. Opponent gets in. Hits us. Man, this lag is going to kill us. Passes. Attack Gideon. Play Storm Tamer. Opponent has Essence Scatter. Pass the turd. Oh my, I can't believe, I can't believe this. I really can't. I am just in, in shock that this game, that we didn't win this game already. Wow. Here comes Gideon. Will we ever draw a champion of wits? Will we ever draw, oh, oh, it's really unreal. Opponent gets in with Gideon. Hits us. And passes. There's champion. All right, play champion of wits. That's a good draw, finally. Opponent's in the tank. I mean, if they counter it, we just eternalize it. Opponent plays cast out. Okay. Gonna cast out our freebooter to get back the disallow. Resolves. Discard Scarab God. Discard Doomfall. Play Freebooter. Opponent disallows. So we look out Dispersal. Freebooter free resolves. Last card's Torrential. Pass the turn. 
activates Gideon. So block with champion of wits. Come on, negate. Opponent passes. Get in at Gideon. Play gifted Aetherborn. Pass the turn. Opponent just runs out Torrential. For Glimmer. Man, I'm going to be so depressed if we lose this game. Really. But it's looking likely. Opponent untaps. Plays a land. Activates Gideon. Cast out. Okay. I'm gifted Aetherborn. Yep. Goes attacking. Yep. Oh, this lag. Moto. Down to 11. Opponent passes. We eternalize. Counter Torrential. <gasps> Draw discard. Discard Liliana. Discard Champion. Hit Gideon. Play a Jace. Make a 2-2. Two -two. Pass the turn. Oh man, this is close. Opponent plays a land. One card in hand. What's their last card? Cycles? Come on. No, not again. Not again. I can't take any more top decks. I just, my heart can't take it. Takes up Gideon. Yup. And passes. So we hostage taker. Get rid of Torrential. Do we have any instants? No. Well, and our poop scoops it up. Oh my goodness, we got there. Oh my god, what a battle! Oh, our opponent fought and clawed, but we came through in the end. What a game! What a game! Good god. Thanks for watching the video. If you're subscribed, make sure to hit that bell icon to get notifications for all the latest videos. It's a great way to support the channel for free, and you can find the next video right here.